But if Barbara were here today, she would have said to her, Melania, your husband had sex with a porn star yeah. while you were home with a baby. Yeah. How do you feel about that? This just goes to show you that their Trump deranged syndrome and their hatred for President Trump is so vile that they were stooped that low. But are you surprised? How are you guys all doing? Welcome to the channel, Modern Renaissance Man. I am Ty Smith. I appreciate you guys taking time out of your day to view my content. If you do enjoy the content, make sure you give it a like. That way this content like this can consistently be recommended to you. And also don't forget to follow me on the platform you see above and the ones below. If you would like a video clip or something you would like me to talk about, react to, things like that, go to patreon.com forward slash Modern Renaissance Man. And that's how you can find out how to do that there. Make sure you read those tiers in their entirety. And I don't have that many open. I don't even have time to really do all that. Once they're closed off, they're closed off. I appreciate the newcomers already, all right? We're going to be kicking this thing off next month, all right? Ladies and gentlemen, also, don't forget to double check and make sure that you still are subscribed to the channel because people are being mysteriously unsubscribed to the channel. All right, got to talk about this, ladies, because the view has, like, the witches of the view, we all know that they stoop to levels that's super low, but they want to go after Melania Trump after her interview. And they are so pissed and mad about President Trump that although, you know what, because I'm almost about to slip off and give it away, but I want y'all to check this out first. American people need to decide what they really want. Maybe some, you know, strong tweets but everything else great for this country. So what do you love most about your husband? His, his being, his humor, his personality, his kindness. He's, he's very special. Uh, his positivity, um, his energy, it's unbelievable. Uh, yeah, so we have a beautiful relationship. What do the two of you like to do for fun? if you're not working. To have dinner, sometimes quiet dinner or dinner with friends and listen to the music, mm -hmm. all kind of different musics. I hear he likes to be the DJ. He likes to be the DJ and um, it's a very uh, fun night when he does that. Yesterday was Barbara Walters' birthday, I yes. believe. Yes. And when I was watching this, I thought if Barbara were here today, she would have said to her, Melania, your husband had sex with a porn star yeah. while you were home with a baby. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Yeah. That's what Barbara would have done. This woman, nothing. This was the most softball thing, the most softball hostage video I've ever well, seen. Well, that's probably why they were able to book the interview, because she yeah. does have a book coming out. And if this is Donald Trump's way of reaching women, he might want to try another route. I, I, and I don't even say that with a lot of shade. Mm -hmm. I find them very unrelatable not people, not yeah. a lot of mm -hmm. shade. You don't think uh, she softened him? Uh, no. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> so I think that people tell you who they are by who loves them and who they love. Mm -hmm. So one of the most powerful moments in the DNC to me was Doug Emhoff's speech. Yeah. When you watch people truly love, they can't fake it. When you're watching them, yeah. I find this like really hard to uh, look at and see a reflection of myself. Like I'm a regular married person. I sleep with my husband in the bed yeah. and like- Me we, too. Yeah. <laughs> with her husband. Yeah. So, yeah, we all do. Yeah. That explains <laughs> snoring, I snoring, snoring it all. Um, <laughs> deal with it. You, just, oh. when you, you know, this is the first time we're seeing Melania in two years. When you love someone, you're there for them, not because they asked you to be there. You wouldn't be anywhere else. Dr. Biden shows up on surprise, uh, like surprising she, yeah, the president yesterday because she had to be there. Mm -hmm. All these other spouses, even Usha, Usha Vance, yeah. how you say her name, I she think. keeps doing all these events. It's it's 
you, that's where you go when your person is pursuing their dream. Yeah. We haven't seen her, and her description of Donald Trump doesn't track with the reality of what we've seen. And I can't relate to the marriage or if they're even in the same place the at delusion, the same time. So I don't think that's the way. The delusion of saying that he has kindness in his heart. He's so mean. Joy, he's, she called him positive. He's the meanest president we've ever had. And I was around when Nixon was here. He does like to DJ. That was true. He yeah, is mean. He loves show to. He, well, he's mean to the hate. Surprised. He's Isaac mean to track. women. He's mean to immigrants. Everybody. He's mean to everybody. But he's he's not, mean maybe to... he's not mean to Melania. Oh, oh but I don't. Oh, I, I don't, don't know if he no, sees wait, her or not. I did good interview. Please don't bury me on golf course. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So what I was going to say, although this woman, Melania Trump, Melania Trump, I'm sorry, almost lost her husband twice. Look how they just want to throw over. They, want, they, they just want to roll over. The fact that President Trump was shot in the ear, technically the head, it missed him, almost lost his life for the whole world to see. And then to have another attempt on his life, but they want to just try to mask over all that by saying if Barbara Walter was here, she would ask them, how come you was at home with your baby and your husband was having an affair with a porn star? What do you think about that? Honestly, Barbara Walters, I got to say this, although a lot of people may not agree with her, she seemed to remain a woman of class. Due to the sensitivity of the situation, I can say in my own opinion, I highly doubt that Barbara Walters would have said anything like that because of the sensitivity of the situation. Now, had it been way before Trump was shot or anything like that, yeah, I can see that being a thing when you were at home with the baby. You know, Barbara Walters get everybody to cry. But I have to completely disagree with Joyless on this that he would have done that and look how they do they like to kind of derail from the things at hand ladies and gentlemen oh overcome it with hum oh overcome it with humor let's laugh about it which is completely fine but at the same time do you need reminding of our current state right now what i mean by that your current state your mentality your finances your grocery store bill your gas prices come back to reality of that because the thing is it can be overwritten subconsciously by humor when people make you laugh, it makes you feel good. That's why at funerals, they serve food because when you eat, it kind of sends off endorphins that get released from the brain. Dopamine gets released from the brain, okay? And what that happens is that you feel a little better until you think about the situation again that you can get sad again. So what I'm telling you right now is that by the funny stuff that the viewer is doing, oh, let's laugh and let's make fun of it, let's do all this. <laughs> no, that makes us think, oh, he's so terrible, he's so horrible. What about your current situation right now and the social economic status right now, huh? Reality hits. Don't forget about that. That's why they want to keep you glued into TV and glued into, oh, look what's about to happen. Kamala's about to be the first this, the first woman. Da, 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 da. Look, 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 look. Take a seat back and look at the reality of the situation right now. Don't forget to leave a comment, ladies and gentlemen. I want to hear what you guys have to say about this. Do you think that was distasteful what she said and what she did? Or do you think, hey, it's fair game? And if that's the case, do you think if Trump sees this, he should throw shots right back at them? Y'all let me know in the comments below after this video. Don't forget, if you want to see the next video that I'm doing that's going to be in chronological order, it's going to be right up there. And if you want to see things that I do as a variety on the channel, it will be down there. I am Ty Smith, Mount Renaissance Man, hoping and praying that every last one of you have food, shelter, and clothing. And most of all, I pray every last one of you guys are in great health, mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually. God bless you all through Jesus.